You came for demon souls? Or to save this land and be remembered as a hero? <laughs> Alant the Twelfths, by channeling the power of souls, brought unprecedented prosperity to his northern kingdom of Boletaria. That is, until the colorless deep fog swept across the land. Boletaria was cut off from the outside world, and those who dared penetrate the deep fog never returned. But Valifax of the royal twin fangs broke free from the fog and told the world of Boletaria's plight. That the old King Alant had roused the Old One, the great beast below the Nexus, from its eternal slumber. And that a colorless fog had swept in, unleashing terrible demons. The demons hunt down men and claim their souls. Those who lose their souls lose also their minds. The mad attack the sane and chaos reigns. Valifax also spoke of the enticing power of the demon souls. Each time a demon claims a human soul, the demon's own soul is invigorated by the life force. And the power of a mature demon soul is beyond human imagination. The legend spread quickly. Mighty warriors lured by the possibilities braved the fissure to breach the accursed land. But none have returned. Pure of the Twin Fangs. Yet the silent chief. Saint Urbane. Skurva the Wanderer. The sixth Saint Astria with her knight. Gal Vinland, and Sage Frake, the visionary. The colorless deep fog slowly creeps beyond Boletaria's borders. Humankind faces a slow and steady extinction. The deep fog will eventually swallow all lands near and far. But Boletaria has one final hope. A lone warrior who has braved the baneful fog. Oh, has the land found its savior? Or have the demons found a new slave? Brave soul who fears not death. I shall guide you to the fissure. So that you may lull the old one back to slumber. You came for demon souls, or to save this land. Well, you slipped through the fissure too, did you? And be remembered as a hero. <laughs> Hunting for demons? Try one of the Archstones. Now go. 
That is why you came, is it not? To this accursed proletariat.